Hey, Sneaky Linux back in today. Oh, oh, I've been busy, boy, I'm really busy. Here we have a Lubuntu 1404 Beta 2. Now, I'm not sure if this one's going to be an LTS, but I think it is off the top of my head, you know. So that'd be cool for Lubuntu 2. But installation went really, really quick, even though this machine's only got 512 of RAM, and it's still running nice and fast now. So I'm impressed, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Tell me. Anyway, it's the usual Lubuntu. Oh, one problem before I go down that avenue. In Zubuntu, I can get the problem with the keyboard and language layout. In this one I have, it's reverted after installation to US keyboard. Okay, yeah? Bit of a bummer. Not big deal to change, really, but hey, it won't do what it wants me to do first time round. So that really needs to be sorted before the final release candidate, or the final is out anyway in about three weeks' time. Wherever well, many weeks it is. Yeah, so that's me a little bit of a moan out of the way. Usual Ubuntu, so I'm not going to show you too much. We hit the menu. As you can see, accessories, it's all the same as it would be. But it's super bleeding fast, okay? So you get archive manager, character map, disk, bloody 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 leaf pad, LX to the mower, and X pad. Graphics, you only get a document viewer, MT paint, and simple scan. If nobody's seen MT paint before, that's what it looks like. Yeah, you just do some painting, baby. You know what I'm saying? So if you want to say do some drawing, so that's art, isn't it? That's that's really cool art that is. Yeah. No, that's enough of that. Loose changes, okay. Under internet, Firefox is still your browser of choice. I kept on saying that it's going to change to Chromium and all that, but nothing ever happens because people like Firefox, unfortunately for people who like Chromium. But then again, because it's Linux, we can have as many web browsers as we like. It doesn't really matter, does it? We get Pigeon for our internet and Slyfed for our mail and transmission for our BitTorrenting, if you do that sort of thing. Office is Abbey Word and Numeric and the Document Viewer again. Sound and video, this is where it lets me down a bit, but as we said before, you can actually install what you really like, so it doesn't really matter. So Audacious, No Man Player, GUVC View for your webcam. It's one of the only ones that has that as standard, do you know that? That's really weird. XF Bird, as you do. For under System Tools, GW, Lubuntu Software Center. I've shown it before, but I'm going to show you one more time in the hood. And it's basically, yeah, you know what it is, that you get what you like. Whether these will be coloured when we get the final one will be another thing. I'm not going to install anything this time around because you can do it yourself. I don't have to do it for you. Okay, but the system tools. Your software update is I've just updated it. It was 120 odd megs worth of downloads to do. It done it in a couple of minutes, no problem at all. I'll open the task manager up for you, and as you can see, I'm not using nothing at all. No. 2% of my CPU and only 113 megabytes of RAM out of the half a gig that it's got, which is very, very good. Because remember, it's open box stroke LXDU. You know what I'm saying? Of course you do. Yes. And the preferences. We still get Bluetooth Manager. You can customise your look and feel. Um, don't take no notice what anybody says to say LXD you can't customise. Of course you can. It's open box to start with. Now, don't give me that disk stuff, man. Don't do it. No, don't do it. Default applications. Your disk input method. Bloody blah, 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 blah. Language support. Yeah. Monitor settings. Big one for me. Blimey, yeah. Network connections. The open box configuration manager. Power manager. If you've got a lap in and stuff. Remember, that actually comes from XFCE. So it's, it's boring stuff from everywhere. Then you get the run and log out. Uh, it's a really short video, so I'm just going to go to the web and just show you the old Firefox browser. See how nice and quick that was? It was super fast, yeah. If I put Lumen 404 in, which I did earlier, as you do, you get all the CD images here. These are for the Beta 1, by the way. So go back to the Beta 2. Why did I do that? Yeah. There's also daily builds if you want to download it. So if you want to download it now and give it a try before the full release, you might as well, mightn't you? You can get them all the way down there, even for Mac and Power PC. Got no Mac Power PC, they're going to be quite old now, and Ubuntu will run fine on it, no problem. But obviously, if you've got an AMD 64 or 64 bit computer, it'll go just like that. So, anyway, Ubuntu 1404, that's all I'm going to show you because that's all I need to show you. I don't need to show you nothing else. I, mean, I can show you some games, but I don't really want to. No, 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 because there ain't any real, is there? No, not this time round. I'm glad they got rid of them. Oh, penguin this, penguin that. Penguin. Just get your own games. Just do what you want. Lovey jubbly. I'm liking it. It's so fast. It's unbelievable. Yeah, rocket plane. Sneaky Linux going out. I see those. Bye bye.